Hey everybody, this is Jay back with another video and this is going to be about my 2025 Kia K5 GT line. I know there's been some talk and some rumors about supposedly these cars using an excessive amount of oil. Um, I'm here to tell you and show you that mine does not. I did just recently check it as you can see here. But I'll pull up the dipstick once again. And I almost have 2,000 miles. But it's right in the middle of that dipstick. About where the tip of the rubber is. As you can see. So with almost 1,600 miles, I haven't used any oil. So that shouldn't be much of a concern on these cars. I know previous models, yes. There was some concern for that. Especially the turbo ones, I guess. All my fluids still look really good. I think that's a Hyundai logo. <laughs> I wonder if they're the same companies. Smart Stream Technology, whatever the hell that is. Um, Car's been running great. I haven't had any problems with it. I do find something strange that I've never seen besides in a Kia. I don't know if maybe it's a new car thing. Um, but if I get in here, these weird bar freaking uh, fuses. Look at that. A whole bunch of fuses all in one. But I love this car. Um, I haven't had any real concerns with it yet. It is under warranty, so I'm not going to have too much of a concern for anything, really. But that's a lot of mini fuses and other fuses. But that looks all really good. I do love that they gave me a good AMG battery in this thing. But I have almost 2,000 miles, like I said. Um, Oh, whoops, I left them up. I guess it doesn't matter all that much. Or does it go down? It should go down to unlock. Yeah. <laughs> Weird locking system for these filters. But it does make it easier to get it in and out. Um, compared to others that I've had. So I kind of actually like that quite a bit. But like I said, I haven't had any issues with this at all. And in the time frame that I've owned it, I almost have, like I said, what, 1,600 miles that I put on it already. And I haven't had any excessive anything. Um, oh, almost 2,000, look at that. Almost 2,000 miles. Oh, it shows the hoods up, that's kind of cool. Um, like I said, I haven't had a single problem with the car, and I don't see where I will. Um, great, great car, really. It really is. I love how it rides. It's got a lot of get up and go for a 2.5 liter. I mean, more than the, uh, <laughs> the previous generations to, what, 1.6 or whatever it was, or 1.9 with a turbo. That thing was absolute garbage. So if you're looking to get a Kia K5, definitely look at getting the newer one the GT line oh wow rubber coating that's a nice touch keep stuff out of that the engine mount it's kind of cool it's got two belts as you can see one there and one there right there see as you can see it's got two belts one there and one there the other one's for the uh, water pump I believe All right, guys, I'll keep posting videos about my car, but like I said, I've had no engine leaks at all. You know, no excessive oils consumption. People were talking about using it, using like a half a quart of oil every thousand miles. I haven't used any in almost two. So, all right, guys, I'll see you in the next one. Have a good one.